Hello and welcome to this Black Myth Wukong guide on how to get the secret cloud patterned stone staff weapon, a powerful and missable item in chapter 2 for you to collect that requires finding 6 Buddha head statues and collecting their eyeballs. Let's begin and we are at the first location which is next to the first shrine in the Fright Cliffs area called Squall Hideout. I'm going to walk you through collecting all 6 of these in order and then we will continue on. Now we have all six, head to the Rock Rest Flat Shrine where the fifth Buddha head was and walk along the left hand side to find a boss called the Stone Vanguard. You need to defeat the boss in order to continue, but it's not too difficult as he's very slow moving. Now he's defeated, you can interact with the stone in the ground and deliver all six Buddha eyeballs, and this initiates a secret boss fight called Shigan Dang. Defeat the boss, who is easier than the previous one, and you're rewarded with several items. The Skanda of Feeling, which is a key item, I'm not sure exactly what it's for yet, so let me know in the comments if you figured it out. But the other item you get is called the Heart of Stone. Head over to the shrine and you can use this to craft the unique weapon called the Cloud Patterned Stone Staff. It not only increases your attack to 60, but increases your defense by a massive 30 points as well, making it super useful to equip as early as possible. Guys, that's it for this video, another Black Myth book on guide. If you want to see more unique weapons, armors, and quests, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.